There's a mirror behind me. Hey everybody, uh, I just wanted to make this cool little short video to showcase some pencils that I got yesterday. And yeah, pencils, I know, right? But I am a huge, huge fan of these pencils by a company called Blackwing. They're most famous for making the uh, Blackwing 602. A lot of artists and animators, musicians, they revered these pencils, they love these pencils. And I am along with those people. This pencil is fantastic. Um, if you don't know the history, there's a brief little uh, history on the back of the box here. I'll read a little bit uh, to it too, just in case if you're interested or not. Blackwing pencils built a cult following among famed 20th century artists, especially authors, animators, and musicians. When they were unexpectedly discontinued in the 1990s, devotees began paying as much as $40 for one pencil on eBay. And there, I've actually seen these people uh, sell these original. So the original brand is called uh, Everhard Faber. That's the original company that produced the Blackwing 602s. And if you want to buy an authentic original one, it goes up to like 50 bucks now. And I've even seen some that sold a single pencil for $200, which is absolutely insane. But Blackwing had come back about 10 years ago and started remaking the pencils. They have these special like volumes of pencils they sell out like with limited quantities of and one of them of uh, the series they release is called as you can see here Blackwing era. So they redesigned and brought back the classic iconic 1930s look of the pencil because the new ones look a slightly slightly different than these original or like these 1930 designs. Like they started, they discontinued, like they said, they discontinued these in the 90s for like, they started producing these things in the 1930s. So they've been around for a while, but then they just continue, like it said, for a couple of years. But so I thought it'd be cool to open up, uh, sharpen one of these pencils here on camera and just show a little video of me doing a drawing with one. And um, I don't know, like I mentioned, like this, uh, these pencils were revered with uh, animators. Chuck Jones is one of those guys that are really famous and well known for using these pencils and loving the Blackwing 602. And it's got a really nice smell, a nice wood cedar smell, which is really cool. But yeah, you get, the box comes with 12 of them. And I'm gonna be uh, using these very uh, cautiously because <laughs> this is not like the first limited box run of Blackwing pencils I purchased from them. So I also have another one. I also purchased a, a bit ago the uh, Blackwing 02.22.22. It's like a it's a red pencil. They're like they're basically used for like making editing for editing notes and things like that. I've used only one of these, and I got these like four months, like probably three or four months ago, and I've only yet to use one, and I haven't even used up that one because they don't they don't make any more of these either. So I gotta spare them. I gotta use them wisely, basically. Going back to the artists and animators, but. Uh, Going back to Chuck Jones specifically, um, I've been fortunate enough to have done some work for the uh, Chuck Jones Center for Creativity. So I thought in honor of Chuck Jones here, we do a, uh, we do a drawing of Daffy Duck. But before we do that, we gotta sharpen this bad boy out. So let's do it. <coughs> All right, just finish sharpening it. Look at that beauty right there. Look at that beautiful 602 right there. And yeah, by the way, all the Blackwing 602s have a saying on them. They all have the uh, this quote on it. It says, half the pressure, twice the speed. I love that. And one of the distinctive things about this version of the Blackwing is that this the gray color on this pencil seems to be just a slight bit darker than the uh, uh, other 602s, like the regular 602s they sell now. And the uh, racer color is different. And then obviously, uh, another big thing was this black like stripe. They used, always have this black like stripe on the eraser bit here. They don't do that anymore. I wish they did. So I think it looks really nice. It doesn't do anything. It's just a nice little aesthetic look to it. But yeah, um, let's cut here and I'm gonna do a drawing of Daffy Duck. And there you have it, uh, a nice little drawing of a Daffy Duck here. 
with the good using the good and legendary blackwing 602 man love this pencil thanks for watching this video everybody hope you've enjoyed it and liked my drawing here and i'll see you in the next video